you get mentioned in my name. We don't like what you say. I don't give a fuck. Y'all can suck my dick. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how to drill your items by product ID so we can set bids at the product level uh, for each individual product. So I'm in another account and I've created um, a new test bucket. So I haven't run these Google Shopping products uh, before. So these are new products um, that I've uploaded to Merchant Center and, uh, and I'll run them and show you how to optimize them um, in the course. So what we wanna do is um, we wanna go into our campaign, our test bucket campaign. So click on campaign. And now we're taken to the ad group level, right? And the ad group uh, should be item ID drill. Click on that again. And then now we're on the product group level. So if you mouse over this all products thing here, it will come up and show you um, how many products have been submitted on Merchant Center, how many approved, how many active, how many ready to serve. So this is all good. This means that our products are active and can run in this campaign. So what we wanna do now is we wanna click on this little add subdivision character. We wanna go here, we wanna to go to item ID, and we wanna select this, that selects all the products. So basically here, what we're bringing in is the item ID of every single product. So then we can adjust bids um, at the item ID level for each product. So now we wanna go save without editing bids. And now you can see under here in all products, We've got, all, we've got every single product separated into its own row, right? And what that means is that we can adjust the bid and using this little pencil icon next to the product that we wanna um, adjust the bid for, right? So if you mouse over this product, you can see that we can actually see what the product is. So when you go ahead and you keep uploading new products into your Shopify store, what happens is the products will come up under everything else in all products, right? So when that happens, um, I'll make another video of, of, of how to do this, but we want to separate out those products so they come here under um, every row. Because right now, say if we uploaded like 10 more products, right, to our Shopify store, then everything else in all products, this row here, right, would include those 10 products. And that means that we could only set one bid for those 10 products. So I'll show you in another video um, how to separate out new products that are uploaded. All right, cool. So now we've got our products separated out into their own um, individual rows. We're just gonna wait um, a few days um, and see, and what we should see is some of these products getting impressions. Because even though this campaign is um, active now, you might not even start getting impressions for like a day or two days. So just wait for about three days and you should see um, the impressions start to build up um, in these campaigns as Google learns when to show your product.